Why do you think it didn't work out between Warner and Haley in Pittsburgh, um, or what you can share? Yeah, I mean, again, I think it was solely, you know, uh, personal-based in regards to uh, just, you know, sometimes we have guys that we don't fit with, coaches that don't seem to, to mesh with our personality. I mean, you can't look at what Todd's done from a football standpoint, whether it be in the past and what he did with us in Arizona – or what he's done there. I mean, he's he's made Ben a better quarterback, a more complete quarterback, and the stats bear that out. I mean, Le'Veon, you know, you could argue the best running back in the league or the most versatile running back in the league. And then A.B. has been the best receiver with the best stats for years. So he's done his job as an offense coordinator in scoring points and putting them in positions over and over again. Uh, I think you solely have to look at it as uh, personally – those two didn't mesh, and we talked about it on our show last week. We were talking about it early on in the stages where they were coming together. And uh, and just being with Todd, I understand why people say that, and I understand where that could go sideways. You know, Todd and I even got into it at times, and I didn't get into it with a lot of guys, but I also knew at the end of the day, A, Todd was going to make me better, and B, everything Todd did was from a competitive standpoint, was – from a standpoint of, I want us to be the best. I want to be the best. I want you to be the best. And that's what I'm going to push you towards. I don't care what you've accomplished. I don't care how long you've been in the league. I don't care what you did last week. I'm going to coach you on this situation in hopes of making you you better and making us better. And when you understand that, and when I understood that, it was like, I don't want to play for anybody but a guy like that. Now, you can do it different ways, sure. But I want to play for a guy that just wants to be the best and wants to push everybody. I saw him getting Larry Fitzgerald's face numerous times about blocking and run after catch and all of that stuff that made Larry better. And it would have been easy to just go, man, he's really good. Let's just – we'll leave him where he's at and everybody else has to play better. But that's not how Todd is. Todd is a guy that will push you and get in your face and is not afraid to challenge even the best players in the league if he thinks he can make them better. Um, and I appreciated that. And I understand why a lot of people look at that and kind of keep him at arm's length. Like, Oh man, I don't know if I want those kind of outbursts or a guy with, you know, that kind of demeanor on my sideline. I tell you what, if you're a competitor and you want to win, whether you're an organization, a head coach or a player, you want a guy like that in your corner. You want a guy like that pushing you every day and taking you to the next level. The Rich Eisen show weekdays at noon Eastern on audience. 